good morning everybody i mean good morning ladies and gentlemen i want to call everybody ladies and gentlemen until we leave the uk nikita has just very kindly made all this hot oh no it's too hot oh crap oh oh i spilled some oopsies did it go on the cord? oh yes. i think i think it did go on the cord i think so too i'm sorry about that it's okay yeah you have to go clean it up for me yeah sorry about oh, that sorry. are you angry at me <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah, why would I be? I don't know. In a way, Nikita has graciously presented me with a copy on this fine morning. How are you today? I oh, am yeah. good. We're going on a road trip. It's, uh, what is it, 6 a.m. at the moment? 6.30. 6.30 a.m. I've been up since 4 a.m. I thought I was over the jet lag, but turns out I'm not over the jet lag yet. Pretty excited we get to start our road trip today. I love road trips. I have to drive. All right, so we're going to enjoy our coffees. Then we have to go to Tesco's to prepare some food for our road trip. And then we'll go pick up the car. But I don't know what car we have. It's like... Probably just something small. Yeah, it's, it's definitely something small, but you don't know what you get. It's definitely going to be way smaller than the one I had to drive in Korea. These are the nice British streets early in the morning. I'm so excited. We better leave soon. Yeah, so there's no traffic. True. It's Sunday morning, so it's super empty. What you gonna get? I don't know. Ah, peace. All right, food and snacks for the road trip. Yay. Check. Guys, this is our nice car. I'm so excited. We almost got jibbed. Oh my god, I know! Because we did purchase a compact car, so I was thinking it was going to be really small, like a. And we were fine with that and stuff, but we requested a GPS, and she was like, oh, instead of paying for a GPS, why don't you just go um, with this slightly bigger car and it's a cheaper rate because it's the weekend? Yeah. And then she was like, oh, it's only 45 pounds, I think. So I'm like, oh, 45 pounds is like $90, yeah. not bad. It turns out she means 45 pounds a day. <laughs> So that's like a few hundred dollars difference because we have it for a week. And yeah. she was like, it wasn't much difference. It was like it's double like double the price. The price. Yeah. Turns out the car she's given us has a GPS anyway. And she was trying to say that the other car is larger and more comfortable. It's exactly the same size. Yeah. It's like this kind of mid sized SUV. Yeah. Why don't I, I keep getting the big freaking cars? Oh, I had a feeling they'd give us a better car. I book a little one and they give me a big one. This is really nice to drive in though. This is awesome. I thought we were going to be in like a tiny little Fiat or something, but yeah. this is nice. This is a road trip car. All right, let's head off to Bath. Wait, did we say we're going to Bath? I'm not sure yeah. whether we said that. We're going to Bath now, which is absolutely beautiful. That was one of the places that left an impression on me when I came here, even though I didn't care about anything or traveling back then, that, that still left the mark on me. So mm. I'm really excited to go back. It's so beautiful. You ready? Yeah, it's in miles, but there's kilometers on there. Wait, so are the street signs in miles or in kilometers? Oh, the, that speed limit is in miles. So... Should we double check? Yeah, I'm gonna go ask. Yeah. Um, I'll be right back. Okay, it's miles. Is which it is, miles? Which is fast because I noticed near us is 40. Yeah. And I thought that was 40 kilometers, but it's actually 40 miles, which is like nearly 70 kilometers. That's weird. Why is it in miles when we use ah. kilometers in the UK? Yeah. And such? And I don't know. And I don't know what the hell is a mile. This is going to be in miles too. Oh my God. The first moments I need the silence and concentration. And look what she's doing. You're putting the pressure on me straight away. When we were in Korea, she wouldn't let me film or she wouldn't even let me talk. I know. She wouldn't let me listen to music. What the hell are you doing? I feel like you're a confident driver now. You'll be alright. You're doing so good. Uh, oh my <laughs> god, this is skinny. Do I go straight? Do I go left? Oh my gosh, I need... No, this is too skinny. Am I going to hit? I need your eyes on that side. because I... Yeah, my, my side's fine. My side's buzzing at me. Oh my god, I hope no one's watching me leave. That's just so embarrassing. We're leaving London. You excited? No, not right now. <laughs> We're out on the street. All right, it's happening, people. Oh my god, I can't handle this. You can do it. No, this is too much. Oh my god. Oh, this car has active stop or the thing where the engine turns off. Yeah. That's cool. 
Yeah. This is a really new car. We've got Bluetooth and everything. Because another reason why she said you get the other car is like it has everything. It has Bluetooth, mm. GPS. So does this car, man. Wow, uh, this one's only done 400 miles, whatever wow. that is. <laughs> Be confident. I just can't wait to get on the freaking highway. <laughs> Honestly, what does this triangle mean? What does this mean? Does this triangle oh, mean give way? Man, relax, man. I can't, I can't. It's so hard. I really want you to drive so you can feel the stress. Oh, we're going in Hyde Park. It's so weird that it's like gated and you just drive through it. This is a little cute Sunday drive. Yeah. Not stressful at all. Not, not in this section, I don't think. I don't know. There's <laughs> not many people around. Well, there's people to come to see me if I stuff up. But not many cars around. <laughs> it's pretty as. Yeah, it is beautiful. Hyde Park, everybody. Very nice. Wow, look how pretty this street is, guys. It's just a random street. All right, we're on the freeway now. Nikita has given me the AOK -okay to <laughs> put some music on and pull out the camera again. She's doing very good. We're on the M4, and it says we are one hour, 40 minutes away from Bath. So I will check in with you guys. We're in Bath, unless something cool pops up. But I'm pretty sure it's just highway driving, and it's not that exciting. All right, see you guys soon. Guys, the weather is so miserable right now. Oh, it's actually got a little bit better. It was like pouring down with rain before. It's, it's actually not raining here, but I think it's raining up ahead. I'm hoping that it lets up for when we want to walk around in Bath. We're still like, a, let's say, an hour away. I think I jinxed us, guys. It's gotten so much worse, we can barely even see. We're on our way to Bath, and look at these nice little houses, guys. It's very cute. Guys, the towns outside of London are so cute. Check this, people just live here. Hard at work concentrating on the roads. Yeah, there, it's a bit crazy right now. You nervous? Yeah, these roads are so tight and it's raining and their roundabouts are ridiculous here. I uh, know, their roundabouts are just painted, so silly. Yeah, I freaking nearly went through one before because I didn't know there was a roundabout there because there's nothing on the road. We are eight minutes away apparently. Thank God, I can't take this anymore. <laughs> of course guys, we picked a day where the road is closed off because there's a marathon going on. We're in the streets of Bath and it's raining so I have my bright yellow raincoat on in case I get lost in the rain and Nikita and she needs to find me. So it's, helpful. It's very easy for her to find me. <laughs> there's some kind of event going on so we parked like a good 15 minute walk away from the Roman Bath. <laughs> How do you feel? This is this is so pretty here. Yeah, I know. Our first stop on the road trip is already so pretty. That's the Roman bars over there. I've been, but Nikita hasn't been before. No, it looks like a little hidden building. Yeah. I thought it would be grand. It looks really small, right? Yeah. But you go inside, you see, you'll see, it's freaking massive. Ooh, shall we go? Yeah. They give you a free walkie-talkie phone so you don't get lost. Shut up. This is the audio guide to a thing. <laughs> like, hello, please tell me about the Roman baths. Thank you. All right, you want to have a look at the bath? Oh, it's there? Yeah, I want to have get your reaction. Oh, it's very dirty. Wow. Wait, so what did they do? I don't understand. I need to listen. I don't know what happens here. <laughs> yes, thank you. I'd love to know. Thank you, yes. Okay. There's uneven surfaces in the museum. It's really funny because everybody has their audio guide, so it looks like the whole place, everyone's just talking on their phone. Look at Nikita. You're looking at the only thermal springs in the United Kingdom. Oh, oh my god. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's harder than it looks, okay? It's a hot. Oh, it's warm. Okay. Wait, are you meant to drink? Yeah, drink. Are you sure you're meant to drink? Yeah. Oh, does it taste weird? Tastes like you're not meant to drink. What's it taste like? Dirty tap water that's hot. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Oh, look how pretty it is. What do you think of the Roman baths? 
Um, it was very, it was nice, it was interesting. I wish there was a, you could actually go in it. Lunch with a nice view. I mean, yeah, okay. It's a view. Lunch by the river? Yeah. It's nice. This is the commercial street, yeah. and like there's a Marcus Spencer's, a JD Sports over there, but it's just like these old buildings. I wish we had this for lunch. Yeah. Look how big these passes are. These oh. are award winning as well. It must be this one, this one's sold out. Traditional Cornish steak pastry. It smells good, you can smell like the buttery pastry. Oh, I can, I'm gonna have a further look with those donuts. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm actually so shattered, I'm too full to try one of those pasties. Because I was super cheap as well, but I just know I'll hurt my belly if I try and eat it. Walking back to the car now, we're leaving Bath. Bath was a nice little pit stop. I loved it. Did you like it? Yeah. Such a pretty city. I didn't realize we'd spend so long here. I thought we'd just see it and then go, you know? Ah, it's nice. Yeah. Time to hit the road again and we're going to drive to our hotel. We're staying in a place in Cotswolds or near Cotswolds so that tomorrow that we, we can explore Cotswolds. It's yeah. what is it, 3 p.m. at the moment? Mm -hmm. Should get there around 4 or 5. So we're going to spend a night in a little town called Cheltenham and then tomorrow we explore Cotswolds which is super cute. I saw the photos. It looks, looks very, very, very cool. And then I, I want to go look at this, the town where Shakespeare was born. See, why do you want to do that? You don't even like reading, you don't enjoy no. literature or anything. No, because the town looks cool. Oh, does it? Yeah, and it just so happens that Shakespeare was born there. Woo! We made yeah. it! I thought Cheltenham was going to be like a really small town, like mm. a small country town, but it's actually like a, it's a bit of a city. A lot of people, yeah, a like, lot happening. It's like a small city and it's very posh, like it looks like this is the type of place where people would have servants. Like all the houses are massive and really rich looking. <laughs> servants? Yeah. Butlers? butlers? Butlers, yeah they have butlers. <laughs> let's go check in, I'm Woo! so tired. Me too. Oh, I want to get over this jet lag already. All right, let's go, guys. All oh, right, see what it's like. Yeah. Free upgrade. Right. Wow, look at the tiles. Wow, what a difference from where we just came from. Oh, so she said there was a free upgrade. Yeah, because she said we're not busy at all. Oh, damn. Yeah. That bed looks so comfortable. Whoa, this looks. Oh, oh my god. It looks so comfy. It's Oh Is it comfy? God. It's so like, oh, just soak into it. We deserve this after where we've been sleeping. I know. Oh, I feel so refreshed and so relaxed being in a comfortable room now. It's 5.19. I've been wanting to fall asleep since we left this morning because of the jet lag, but I'm going to not take a nap. I might actually have a coffee even though it's almost 6 p.m. It's almost dinner time because... I want to stay up and I want to wake up at a normal time tomorrow. We're just going to end it here because we're not going to do anything more interesting tonight. We're, we literally don't even have accommodation or plans booked for tomorrow, which is just nuts. So we're going to do some planning. We're going to do some booking of accommodations. Tomorrow night, where are we going to be ended up? Are we in a with... pool, I think. All right. That's where we're sleeping. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow. We'll be exploring Cotswolds and the birthplace of Shakespeare. Yeah. Something something Avon. Something something Avon. Yeah. And then we'll end up in Liverpool. Alright, see you guys tomorrow. I'm still here. Alright, bye. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining us everybody. Make sure to subscribe if you're not already and then watch this video next for 25 years of good luck.